So thank you to the water store right down the road here. These guys, I got to hang out with them. Uh, you can find them over on uh, Lake Creek Parkway and FM 620 North behind the Dairy Queen. Don't go to the Dairy Queen. <laughs> But no, I started drinking the Kangen water. I don't know if y'all heard about it, but it's alkaline water. I started drinking this stuff, I don't know, about se seven months ago, six months ago, whenever I started doing the bodybuilding thing right after I got my surgery. And it's helped me more than any other supplement that I've had. It's truly been a great thing. It led me into believing that I could do the bodybuilding that I'm out there doing now. When I first started posting pictures, show, you know, showing off the guns and showing off my back and my traps and all this other stuff, I first started posting those pictures. People, literally, people on my Facebook would say, that's gross. You shouldn't do that. You're taking it too far. You're an extremist. I'm right. That's right. I'm an extremist because I'm going to reach this goal for me. But it was a good opportunity to talk to those people. I, I personally emailed or messaged every one of them said, hey, let me tell you something. I appreciate your concern, but this is my goal. I'll say, just like your goal is something different from mine, whatever yours is. I said, don't judge somebody for what their goals are. You can't, you can't do that. You got to worry more about yourself than you worry about everybody else and what they're doing around you. I was like, and if you do that, you'll reach what your goal is, and maybe you'll be the inspiration to help somebody else. But I kept getting all those kind of mail and stuff like that. But it, this, this kind of led me on to my journey, what I could do, what I felt like I could do. I started street, you know, s slimming down, started getting the little V going into my shorts and everything, started feeling good about myself. And all of a sudden, my wife was like, hey, <laughs> I like that. It changed a little bit, you know. I was, you know, picked her up one day, was carrying around the house. She was like, ooh, I like this too, you know. So she got excited about it. She was a little more happy then, you know, that I was out there doing the bodybuilding thing. But that finally led me to, you know, saying, hey, if I'm going to take this bodybuilding thing serious, I got to be serious about it. I got to find what the next step is for me because you always got to find that next step. And for me,